one of the the best albums or artists that you guys did work with was Warren Zevon, and of course, you know, Excitable Boy and and that whole album. Can you talk about your work with Warren Zevon and and playing with him? Oh, I I loved it. Mm-hmm. You know, I mean, Warren was absolutely one of the most brilliant, unique, kind of off the wall characters I've, I've ever known. And it was always a treat to be in the studio with him. You kind of never knew what to expect. And he listened to his lyrics and he just thought oh, this cat is like, this. you'd love to be, you know, on the inside of the skull watching the synaptic overload take right. place in there. Um, but I, you know, I, I really miss Warren, you know, and I, I don't think, I think the two guys that handled their imminent demise better than anybody in the world was Warren, Warren and oh. Bowie. Oh, right, and right. Bowie it had this kind of whole plotted, his whole album, his yeah. whole idea of, you know, yeah. what going to be his last time. Right. And Warren was kind of the same way, like when he was on Letterman, and he knew he was going to not be there. And you just go, this is deep. This is, yeah. you know, so he was a, he he was deep, in a, but wrapped up in a whimsical kind of, yeah. you know, paper. Right, right. So, yeah, just miss him, really miss him. Yeah, agreed. Just a, an incredible artist. And did you also tour with him as well as no. be on the record? No, no. No, a lot. You know, the thing is, when I look at, you know, when I'm embarrassed enough to have to look at my discography, you know, most everybody on that I never got to tour with. Okay. You know, it, it was always studio work. Okay. Um, you know, I mean, I've toured with, with a number of people, but um, there's just not enough yeah. opportunities. And, and most of these guys... We would have. I mean, we were very lucky when we were able to juggle between James and Jackson. Yeah. Um, you know, but that was a whole rhythm section, and we wanted to do it all. So we made had their offices all talk to each other. But it's like, you know, I wanted to go back out with Toto again right. last year, and I couldn't do it because Phil came out of retirement. Right. So, right. you know, it's just one of those things. You know, you do you do what you can, and then you lament what you're not able to do because you want to do it all. 